Hello my fabulous people. Hope everything is good with you. So today is um, I'm making a makeup tutorial and it pretty much is going to be my current go-to look. Um, I'm not going to say everyday look because most likely I don't have an everyday look. I change my looks just about every day if not every other day. So um, I'm going to call it my current go-to look. <laughs> okay guys, so let's get started. First thing I'm going to start with is my brows. I've been mainly going for a very go um, easy brow. If y'all guys don't mind the wind because it's really hot. So yeah. Hopefully y'all guys don't hear the outside. So the first thing I'm going to use is my Jordana Fabi Brow in dark brown. And I'm just going to just fill my brows in. Um, I don't know if y'all guys know, but I actually have lights, guys. <laughs> like... Um, I got them a bit ago, not too long, maybe a month, a month or two ago, and I just absolutely love them so much. It's pretty much a ring light, and I've been wanting a ring light for a long time, and I got it for a really good deal. So, this will be like a talk through type, um, makeup tutorial. Thumbs this up if you really like these type of makeup tutorials. I don't know. Like me, I'm kind of in between with talk through makeup tutorials because I live in New York City and y'all guys are going to hear noises and everything like that. That's why I really don't really do talk through um, videos like that. But lately, I've been doing them a little. <laughs> okay, so brows are pretty much good as I would like them to be. So now I am going to use my brow mascara, which is the Essence Brow Lash and Brow Mascara. I love this mascara. It stays, when you put this on, it stays. It's not going to move at all, like your pencil. It could be pencil or it could be eyeshadow. It will not move. Lately, I haven't really been like going for like a really slick or like sharp brow I normally don't really go for sharp brows I normally like I go for like brows that are like close to natural cause I don't know I'm just not into that sharp brow type look next thing I'm using is my um Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation. Man, I had hate and love with this with this um, foundation. I really did. One minute, when I first started, I couldn't stand this. It just felt like it was melting. It was winter time when I tried this, and it felt like it was melting off my face. Like I just didn't like it at all. And then I tried it again in summertime and it was just moving all over my face and then I found a way of how to work with this so I got you really gotta shake this foundation and I tried it with one of my BB creams and my BB cream was like oh here it is so I got I was trying to find my brush I use a stipple brush with this it goes it works very well I hope you yeah, hope it's still recording. I just use one pump. But yeah, I used the BB cream and then I used this over it, like on top, and it worked. It stayed on and I also used the powder. Oh my gosh guys. I totally forgot to put my primer on guys. Usually I use my Smashbot primer. But since I forgot, whatever but always use a primer don't follow me i just totally forgot but yeah i used the powder with it and it stayed on so i had to like it i had to work with it but after i found a way for it to stay on and now i don't know if it's my skin type change or the foundation because i had this for like a year and some months 
and um and now it just stays on like I just put primer on and it stays on I don't have to do no powder or anything so because it's like it's getting colder and everything it's like fall um I don't really do a whole lot of like powder because it really dries my skin okay and so like I said I don't put any powder on so I just leave it like this and now I just go for I guess I'll go for lashes so I can let this set in a little bit for mascara I've been using my benefit their real mascara and I use the it's um, tight line mascara too I love those two mascaras they're really good okay and now I use my blush I go for my blush um, the blush I'm using is my Wet n Wild in the color Mellow Wine Blush. And I just use any blush. But I've been really loving this look, guys. It's just so easy to do. Like, one, two, three, done. And there's times where I will do a liner. And there's times like I won't do a wing. But for the past four days, I've been doing this look, and I've just been loving it. I haven't really been, like, I've been kind of lazy with the eyes. I haven't really been wanting to put shadow. Now I'm using my Ruby Kisses um, highlighter and light. Well, actually, it's a bronzer, but as they say, a bronzer. But it's really a highlighter, guys. Oh, that cool air feels so good, guys. It is so hot in my apartment. Like, seriously hot. Because they bump up the heat, which I'm so grateful for. But there's times like this where the heater is, like, right here. So, you can imagine. That's why I had to open the window. I was like, mm, -mm. Girlfriend is not cooking. No, no. Not in the mood to cook. So guys, um, also other updates, I've been like, haven't been doing so much videos lately, there's a reason for that. Um, lately, I've been just kind of like, just trying to recuperate from the summer. The summer was kind of like, it was okay, you know, it was kind of sad because my mom passed away and that was like really upsetting for me god that was so upsetting for me but um i stay strong and i keep doing what i love to do because i know she will want me to do that and she would want me to stay strong and everything and not be all crying i do have sad moments where i do cry once in a blue but i don't do it a lot um which is good, it's good, because I gotta keep living my life, I gotta keep doing me, I know she will be looking down and proud of me to do what I do. But that's maybe, that's one of the reasons why, also I've been working too, um, just keeping busy. But that is the reason why I haven't been really doing a lot of videos, or I haven't really, like I'll do the videos, but I haven't really been uploading. That's the reason. So, um... I hope y'all guys still stay with me and you know keep subscribing like for the people that subscribe to my channel thank you very much for the people that stay subscribed to my channel thank you very much I really appreciate it okay so for lippy I'm gonna use my bomb wet and wild um, bomb stain and made you pink it's a color I normally don't go for, but lately I've just been loving. I've been loving this color. I don't know. And I did say I wasn't going to go for a pink. 
lip because I know most of the time I go for a pink lip. I'm sorry, guys. It's a habit. And I think that's that's pretty much it, guys. It could be this color or you know what guys I'm gonna stay what I said and I'm not gonna go for a pink lip but this is one of the um, go-to like lippy I, I stay with so I'm gonna wipe it off for it stains y'all guys know I love my stains I always most of the time on my makeup tutorials I go for stains they just they last on your lip you don't have to keep replying I'm gonna go for my Jordana bomb stain. I don't know the name of this bomb stain. It's Twist and Shine bomb stain, but I don't know the name of this one. It's very something, but um, I'm gonna have it on the screen. It's just a berry color, perfect for the fall. It's not too far from the color I had. It's darker and more berrier. Okay, or you could do this lip option, the berry, for like the fall and everything, even though the other lip is great for the fall too. But yeah, this has been my go-to look. I hope you guys like. If you do, don't forget to thumbs up this video and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel guys. Join the fat family. And yeah, remember to stay real and fabulous. And I will definitely talk to you guys next time. Bye.